welcome back to my channel today's tutorial I'm going to be recreating one of Erica La Pearl's look on Cardi B that she did for her wish wish video it is this like pop pink glossy lid I am living for this look I actually thought that my crease was going to crease by now but it is actually holding on pretty pretty well so I'm literally living for this look i did not expect it to come out like this i thought it was going to be a hot mess this is also a full face of first impressions so i can't wait for you guys to see my reaction on some of the products that i try out today if you want to know how i got this look right here then please keep on watching so before i get into the tutorial i just quickly wanted to show you guys and talk about these gummies that i've been eating lately and they are so so good like they help you relieve stress help you go to sleep they're just so bomb so I'm literally like running out and I need to get another one I just thought I should quickly just show you guys what it is for those of you who have problems with like anxiety or problems falling asleep they're called not pot so the name pretty much says what it is they do have CBD in them they do not have THC so they are literally not gonna get you high they are hundred percent organic and they literally just relax you so since I'm gonna be editing after this video I'm gonna just take one because this helps me just like relax chill when I'm gonna be sitting down or like if I'm going to bed I love to just eat one of these because they literally just help me calm down because I don't know what it is but I can't mm, they taste so good by the way so for me I always have a little bit of issue going to bed especially because I'm always on my phone or always doing something but these literally just help you relax and next thing you know you are out like a light I'm gonna be putting the link in the description box so don't forget to check those out I highly highly recommend these if you have anxiety or anything like that so check that out the first thing I'm gonna be doing is applying some tape to the outer corners of the eyes and this is just going to help us get that super sharp outer V and we're not even gonna have to work for it For concealer and powder today, I don't have any new products that I want to discuss in this video. So I'm just going to go ahead and just use the one that I normally use, which is Tarte Shape Tape. And this one is in the shade Medium. So I'm just going to be applying a little bit of that to the lid, blend it out, and then I'm going to go over it with some powder just to really lock that in. Now I'm just going to go ahead and set that with some powder. And the one that I always use is obviously the Peach Perfect from Too Faced. It is literally my all-time favorite powder. Like, I use this every single day. Every single day. The palette I'm going to be using today is a new one, and it's from Morphe. It is the 39S. And look at these beautiful colors. Like, I cannot get over this. The first shade I'm going to be going into is going to be this matte pink shade right here. The reason I decided to do my eyes first today was because I am going to be doing a super, like, colorful pink eye. I actually got inspired to do this look from my very good friend, Erica La Pearl. She is Cardi B's makeup artist and she just did this like hot hot pink like glossy lid on Cardi for the Wish Wish video and I was obsessed. I'm just taking this and applying this on the crease and blending it outwards. I love how easily to blend like all Morphe's eyeshadows are. Next up, I'm going to be going into this hot pink shade right here. I'm going to be taking the same exact brush that I use to apply that light pink shade and I'm going to bring this color a little bit lower than I did that light pink one because I do still want that one to show you just want to make sure that both of the shades are very blended because we do not want to see no harsh lines in this look and I'm just taking this color and I'm gonna be building it up because I really really want this to be hot pink like you guys if you have not checked that video out you have to her eyelids are just Fire. they're like super super pink next up I'm gonna be going into this hot pink shade right here look how pigmented oh my god this is beautiful I'm just going to be packing that on the lid and then we're gonna blend that upwards so don't worry about any harsh lines that you might see right now because they will be blended These eyeshadows are so easy to blend. Like, it's so hard to find sometimes, like, good color matte eyeshadows that actually blend and you can actually build on. And these are just everything and more. 
I love I am so happy that I actually went ahead and did my eyes first because you guys see that I am getting a little bit of fallout. Imagine if my face was already done. Ugh, that would have been terrible. And I'm just going to be using this shade right here. A pencil brush. Ooh, this is pretty. I don't think the camera is picking up like the lilac. It's looking more like white on camera, but in person, it's literally the prettiest shade. I'm just going to be going in with this liquid liner from Tarte and I just got this super dope mirror from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Look how gorgeous this mirror is and it matches perfect. Now I'm just going to go ahead and fill that in. Whew. I'm going to take a Neutrogena wipe and just remove all this fallout we had quite a lot of fallout let's cover up a little bit of the marks that I have for foundation today I'm gonna to be trying out the Tarte found clear foundation I have not tried these I don't I'm not sure if they're like super brand new or if they have a couple weeks or months out but I um, was looking through my foundation drawer and I just realized that I have not tried this one so I was like let me try it out and see what's up so I'm gonna be using two shades today I'm gonna be using medium sand and I'm gonna be mixing it with medium sand tan this packaging is super cute so it's like that and then you just pop it open like that the back of my hand looks a mess right now okay she is definitely um, a little bit like oily, I would say, I feel like. But let's see how she sets. I mean, it just feels very hydrating right now. So this foundation is a super, super duper full coverage. Like, I know I applied my concealer prior to applying it, but it's just literally covering everything. Okay, Tarte. I don't know how it's going to wear out throughout the day, so I'll keep you guys updated on that, but it's actually really really good right now it's like blending and it's covering everything to contour my face today i'm going to be trying out the new huda beauty tantor contour and bronzer cream and this one is going to be in the shade tan i swatched this one on my hand and it is so creamy so i am super excited to see how it's going to blend out because i actually haven't used it like on my face so let's see i'm just taking that on a flat brush Oh, this was just one swipe on this and I'm already like about to have my whole face contoured. This literally just melts into the skin. This is wild and it blends like so light. It looks so harsh at first, but look how lightly it's just like melting into the skin. So it's not giving you like a super harsh contour. So now I'm just going to go back in with my shape tape and just highlight the rest of my face. Now I'm just going in with that Too Faced Peach Perfect powder and I'm just tapping that into the skin. I'm going to be going back into that Morphe palette and I'm going to be taking that second pink shade that we use which is this one right here and I'm just going to smoke out my lower lash line for the gloss I'm gonna be using the ColourPop ultra glossy lip which is this one right here so pray for me that this look does not fall apart because I am so scared of a glossy lid but we're just gonna go with it so here we go So next I'm just going to go in with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and I'm just going to apply a pound or three or four to the top and bottom lashes.
For falsies, I'm just going to be applying my favorites and they are the Lily Lashes in Miami So Extra. And you could use coupon code MELLY23 for money off. These lashes are literally one of the best I've ever tried. Like, So next up is blush and I'm going to be trying this new one from Too Faced. It's called the Fruit Cocktail Blush Duos and this one is in Like My Melons. I always love how cute the packaging from Too Faced is. Like they literally never let me down. I'm just going to be mixing both of these shades. Oh my god. It smells so good. To highlight my face, I'm not gonna be using a new highlighter. I'm actually gonna be going into BH Dual Highlight Palette. So I'm gonna be mixing these two shades. I just literally cannot get enough of this highlighting palette. To line my lips, I'm just gonna be going in with Jeffree Star Celebrity Skin. For lipstick, I'm just going to go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Coconut. The perfect match to this lip liner because it like, it didn't turn it super light. It actually just gave it like a little more of a brown tone. Of course, we cannot have a glossy lid without a glossy lip. So I'm going to be going in with Wonder Beauty's Lip Retreat and this one is in the shade Skinny Dip. Oh my god. This is so pretty. Oh my god, this is literally the perfect shade of nude. So next up is setting spray, and I'm going to be using the new Huda Beauty Resting Boss Face Spray. So I'm just going to go ahead and just bathe in this. Oh my god, this smells so good. It doesn't like spray your face with a lot, a lot of product. It's like kind of like a mist, which I actually really do like. I do not like to feel like something's like wet like I just slap my face with a fucking water balloon or something so I do not like setting sprays like that so I really really like that this one sprays like that and it really does smell good last but not least I thought since I'm wearing like I am wearing a top guys by the way it's just a halter so since I am wearing this type of top I thought it would be a great great idea to try out the new Anastasia shimmer body oil and this one is not like a one that you pour it's a spray on one so I'm really really excited for this I'm just gonna go ahead and spray it all over my chest oh my god oh my god this is really really pretty all right guys so this is the final look I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this tutorial. Let me know in the comments which product was your favorite one that I used today or which one you would want to try. If you enjoyed watching this tutorial, please don't forget to click thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And also, if you speak Spanish, subscribe to my Spanish channel. I'm going to be linking it down in the description box. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me as well. At the Fashion Freak with two Ks at the end. Comment down below and let me know any ideas on any looks or videos, challenges, whatever you guys want to see on this channel. Channel, please let me know in the comments because I will be going through those and I'll see you guys on my next video.